hit it. Morning, welcome to Car Rides with Connor. The time is 7.04, we're, we're, we're February 9th, that we're just leaving the driveway. Per, what do we like to say? Perfect. Per huge, dude. Per huge. <laughs> oh. It is, oh shoot, I'm hitting a tree. Do you hear that? I hope you've got, you've got insurance on this thing, right? <laughs> I wouldn't file a claim for me being a donut and driving into a tree. <laughs> How am I hitting the tree? You know what it is? We have so many drivers in our house and our, literally our driveway looks like, oh God, the school bus. Let's try to beat it. It looks like a valet parking lot. Yeah. Okay. The school children have been picked up. Now we know. But we're, now we know the, we're late. Yeah. But the good news is, is as I'm sure you probably probably mentioned on previous episodes, Jack's looking for a new place to live. But no, <laughs> that's not, he's not yet. He needs. Well, he needs no, to get not, through school. Well, not yet. Not yet. He's he's look. He, he needs to get through school. Graduate. Yeah. And to maybe then find a new place to live. Coco, Coco. Or a job, or, you know, yeah, you yeah, can't yeah. pay rent with good looks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good looks don't, good looks and heart sadly don't pay the bills. They don't pay the bills. Um, what was I going to say? Oh, gosh, Coke, stop. You've got a pretty snappy new mug in our collection, eh? Yep. What you got going on there? Why don't you hold it up closer? This is a mug that was sent to me by the crew at Wonderstorm, who... Who help made the who make the drag who work on the dragon prints? Mm -hmm. It's as you can see, the it has a little depiction of bait King Ezrin's pet glow toad dressed like a little pirate. What did I always used to call him a glow frog? Yeah, but he's a glow toad. There's a difference between frogs and toads, like mom. What? What's the difference? Well, for example. Well, toads are slightly bigger in size and have warts, except bait has spots and a tail. So he's like a hybrid edition. Yeah, and he looks uh, and he looks more. So, do you kiss prince frogs or toads to turn into princes? Which one? Frogs usually. But uh, but did you know in Louisiana, frogs' legs are considered a delicacy. <laughs> Oh, come on. They have some of the best food in Louisiana. They eat alligators. Jack William, I mean, Connor. What? How much meat could literally really be on a frog leg? First of all, that's grossing me out to think about it. How much meat is on it? Well, that Even depends. saying the word meat and frog leg makes me gross. Yeah. But, well, we just went somewhere recently for dinner, and it was all kind of Cajun, Louisiana, and you. Yeah, it was called. Went, you, we had alligator. Yeah, we, yeah, gator, nah. Nuggets, I call Gator them. Nuggets. Yeah, alligators actually have the most succulent meat. The fun fact is, most of it is in the tail. Ooh, like lobsters. Yeah. The oh, best. Oh, an alligator is kind of like a crustacean. Uh, but they have no, an exoskeleton. No, no, no. Uh, no, not really. Alligators are reptiles. Oh. Lobsters are crust. are crustaceans. Crustaceans have no endoskeleton, no inner skeleton. Oh, alligators have bones inside? Yes. Yes. And leathery skin. And whereas crustaceans have tough outer shells. Mmm. So. Yep. Yeah, but what's Louisiana also interesting yeah, is that down. the color of this mug is also the same color as the persimmon jelly found inside need a jelly tart <laughs> why why do you come up with all oh, so many vocab words before 8 a.m mm. all of the vocab words in webster's dictionary are flowing out of your mouth did you really think my head was full of hot air no but after hanging out with you for 24 years i think mine is <laughs> i think i'm the village idiot next to you Oh, we got a cool video yesterday from Ravi Patel. Yeah, for those of you who Thank don't you. know, he actually starred in the first Transformers movies. For those of you who don't know, Ravi Patel was actually the funny international operator guy who Lennox was on the phone with in Qatar when he and his team were being attacked by Scorponok, the Scorpion Decepticon. First of all, he also messaged me back. He loved your thank you video. And Even, he was like, Scorponok, was actually, who is Scorponok? 
You the, feel like our camera tipped, don't you? Yeah, our camera. yeah. It definitely hit it. And for those, okay. I'll make a camera adjustment as we stop safely. Yes. We are in a stopped position for people who comment and get mad at me the way I drive here in the morning. Yeah. <laughs> like, I get lots of comments. People want to see you just travel mugs. But look at me. Cheers. We like to live dangerously. Come by. With our regular drunk mugs. Come by. That's uh, that how mean? the Japanese say cheers. Did Emily teach you that? Nope. It was something I picked up. Oh. And it means cheers? Yeah. Oh, cool. Um, sorry, I interrupted us about the camera. We're, we're, oh, we were talking about Scorponok and... Yes. The, the... That, yeah. For those of you who don't know, Scorponok is a scorpion-like Decepticon, though I think he's actually supposed to be a Predacon. But, but the point is... Ravi Patel sent, sent a video of him on set for his... New show, Animal Control. Yes, that's right. It, and there was a special guest appearance from Ken Jeong. Well, there's lots of cast members and that were wonderful and they were yes, saying I know, hello. I know they were all saying hello. Yes, they were. Or, gotta give them credit too. So. But, anyway, it's been crazy. It's been... Yeah. Okay. Hey, it's been it's been three weeks today since Love on the Spectrum premiered, and yeah, our lives changed because yeah. three weeks and one day ago, we nobody knew us. We were just a bunch of and nobodies just like that, living life in Georgia. Just like that, there was who I was before, and who I was after. Yeah, you like to snap the old fingers, don't you? Yep. You think it helps emphasize things? Sometimes. Give it a little yeah. snap a room. Yes. First of all, I'm still kind of grossed out about the frog legs, but I'm trying to move on from it in my head. Well, what about gator meat? You thought that was good. I didn't mind that, but listen, you could deep fry just about anything well, what and about, I'm in. Well, what about, about a bunch of little crawdads? Is that crawfish? Yeah. I've, I've been to a crawfish boil. Those are fun. Yeah. But I think you're right. You, you all know, the, the good you, meat is in the tail. Yeah, yeah. In fact, fun right? fact, there are actually a lot of ways to cook crawfish in Louisiana. You can, uh, Are we going to do like a Forrest Gump scene, like shrimp gumbo, shrimp scampi, <laughs> yeah, yeah, shrimp. Yeah. Are we yeah. going to do Bubba like crawdad Yeah, yeah, yeah. Steam, Bubba was... Crawdad fried. I remember all, all, those, all those things Bubba was listing for... Well, he was hoping to open a shrimp I just don't know. I felt restaurant. like we were teeing up for something like that with crawdads. Are we you about to do that? You can boil crawfish. You can... And fry them. Maybe. Um, you can, uh, let's see. Oh. Fricassee. Oh, yeah, maybe you can. Uh, <laughs> making that. You can probably, cr I mean, craw crawfish are basically just tiny little shrimp of the land. They're, they're usually You know what's gross small. about those? And I used to love shrimp back in the day. But as I get older, the you know, your tastes change, whatever. Um, aren't all of those things bottom feeders? I.e. eating... The shit off the floor of wherever snails they live. are bottom feeders. Yet, in, yet they eat them in France. What? Haven't you ever had escargot before? I'm sorry. I don't know that I know where France is. I know where France. France. That's how, I how want the to French know pronounce it. Who raised you? An American woman, and you're you're so intercontinental. France, France. The white man came from Europe. Okay. Originally. Well, not a rich, I mean, all life started in Africa before the, then there was the great migration in the men. You're just and, oh, well, well, the rest my, is history. My point was, I don't even know what it was. We've gotten so derailed this morning. We're off the rails this morning. It's, it, it's Friday. Yeah. How about that? There's some good news. Ooh, we're not going to spoil anything, but we have an exciting weekend planned. Yeah. Hush, hush. Yep. And... We are going to be posting on the socials. So if you do follow us, Connor is at Connor Tomlinson5, and I'm at Smithinson8. And we got some cool stuff going on this weekend, but we're not going to say it's going to be so fun to just post it. Yep. Right? Mm -hmm. How excited are you? On a, on a scale of 1 to 10, 10 being like your head's going to blow off. Um. On a scale of 1 to 10, I give it a 9. I'm at a 15. Hmm. 
So my head blew off and my arms and legs. Yeah. <laughs> I'm so excited. Yeah. Um, okay, I'm sorry, you were gonna say something. Um, uh, uh, what was I? This has been a chaotic car ride. I feel like it's we, been a crazy, like busy we, week. Oh, wasn't it? Last night I cooked three different dinners. Because yeah. I'm on this new nutritional plan. Let's say it that way. Yeah. And I, I just got out a new bookcase and had to donate a couple of books. Well, I think it's time to, you know, we're going to donate them. Yeah. We thanked the books for their service. Yep. We're going to send them off to new homes so other people can enjoy them. Yeah. Because we, we can Better not... that than to throw them out. Or worse, burn them. No, we wouldn't do that. But we also don't want to be um, invited to be on another show called TLC Hoarders. Because that's oh, not how we yeah, roll, yeah, is yeah, it? No way. No way. We got to purge. Gotta purge. It, we got to purge. We got to keep the house. Just, it's just sad. Down. All the clutter everywhere. You can't go well, anywhere. It's actually a, a disorder. So oh. we just want to be kind and give grace to those people. But yeah, we will. We particularly, you, you could get there pretty quick if I let you. You could, we got to purge. We got to clean things out and stay fresh. Yeah. But I am glad to see how open you are to it because I'd say about five years ago, we, you really difficult when we had to clean out your closet. You had a very hard time letting go of things. Mm. Do you remember? Yeah, some things you have for a long time. But I mean, it was like stuffed animal stuff. It wasn't yeah. even like, hey, Connor, let me take that keepsake your grandmother gave you. I would never do that. But it was like a stuffed toy and you were struggling to let it go. But now, as you've aged into a, a man, Yep. You uh, you do great. You you, yeah. you recognize that hey, I don't need all this stuff. Yeah. Uh, by the way, you might you want to check the trunk. No, I can hear the books that you loaded last night shuffling around back there. Yeah. I think I might just whip it into a Goodwill. I don't know when because the line is always wrapped around the building. Yeah. I must have a sign on the back of my bumper that says please tailgate me to the point where you're going to be in the back seat and on the show with us. Mm. It's been like two tailgaters this morning. It's yeah. annoying. A two second time distance between vehicles is safe. Yeah. So please do not follow me that closely. Alright. Oh, we never looked at your fruit tree tag that you took a picture of. Oh, yeah. It, uh, we are so epically late right now. This uh, is not the moment. Good God. I know. Oh, I, we didn't film every day this week, and there was a day we got here early. What day? Uh, yesterday. We did good then. So we're not completely hopeless. I got him here yesterday on time. Oh, the whole world. Dude, the whole world's coming in here. Seven seventeen. Bit morning. early for grocery shopping. Golly. Or maybe they're getting stuff to go to work. Yeah. All right, do your epic swing along. All right, thanks for watching, guys. Be sure to leave a like, hit the subscribe button, and stay classy, Planet Earth. I was lip syncing yep. your part. Okay, just throwing all the Sorry. things on me. I got to do this little thing called drive the vehicle. Oh my gosh, I forgot to bring that in last night. That's from your post office box. Oh. Do you need me to read it really quick? We already did the sign up. Sure. Part. You want me to read it? Sure. From San Diego says, hey Connor, we loved you on the show. Oh, okay. We saw you wearing a San Diego hoodie on your Insta and wanted to send a postcard. You reading Dune to Coco made our week. Oh, Aww. Coke, you too. Um, wishing you the best of luck on your journey towards love. Hoping to see you in the next season. Mm. Mm, if we get asked to. Um, if there is one, we don't even know that there's one. You are friends in San Diego, Cody, Derek, and Lauren? 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 Lauren. Lauren. Yeah, I, think I think it's think Lauren. So. I, think I so. love that name. I wanted to name Anna Lauren. Yeah. But we lived on Lauren Lane, yeah. and I thought it was cheesy. Yeah. Yep. Anyway, Back where we lived uh, in Massachusetts. Uh, anyway, okay, do your sign off again because uh, we wrecked the sign off. One more time. I love it. All right. Thanks for watching, guys. Be sure to leave a like, hit the subscribe button, and stay classy, planet Earth. Okay, bye. bye. Hey, Jack's picking you up. You have a haircut. Bye. Bye. Okay, bye. I'll just sit here and have all the things in my lap because that's what we do. Okay. 
Happy, happy Friday, everybody. I don't have to work this weekend. Plus for me, 48 hours of relaxing. And I um, just want to thank everybody again for the likes, the subscribes. Really so happy you guys are enjoying our channel. Um, so wild and cool to me. Anyway, thanks a million. Have a fabulous weekend, a blessed weekend. Stay safe, make good decisions. I am a mom, make good decisions. And uh, love you, mean it. And we will see you next week. Go get some rest. It's been a long one.